This is the setup of my smart chicken coop door. It allows me to open and close my chicken coop door with uh, my smartphone. And I also have the option to control the operation with this manual switch. Um, there are two modules that communicate with my Wink Hub, which then communicates through the internet to my smartphone. And I can either use a timer that's on the Wink app or just choose the open and close function on the, on the, um, the app. Actually, it's just an on or off switch, but um, that's why I have to use one module, one smart module dedicated to opening the door. And then I have to use a, another module dedicated solely to closing the door. The uh, motor is within this antenna unit. A lot of people who are creating chicken coop doors that are automatic are using these automatic car antennas and I'm no different. I thought it was a brilliant idea, so I'm stealing that idea, but I'm taking it one step further because I want to automate it with my smartphone. So I've uh, wired it up and I can make it work with my smartphone. But the problem I'm facing is that the antenna is so slow when all three of these wires are connected. When I disconnect uh, two of the power sources, the sole functioning power source allows, allows me to control this antenna. Really, I mean, it just goes so much faster. And as soon as I connect just one, one more, it starts to fail and go much slower. But I don't know, I'm thinking I have like a wiring problem. And that's why I'm here on the internet to ask somebody, maybe somebody would know what exactly I did wrong. I'm gonna post my wiring diagram. I mean, I don't, I'm not an electrician, so my wiring diagram is gonna look real funky to someone who's, who's versed in this kind of uh, art, but not me. I'm just trying to use common sense to operate this thing. Hopefully you can understand my, my diagram. Thank you for watching.